It depends. What do you want to have happen to your house, right? So everything is negotiable. How much equity is in the house? Is it imperative for you that you stay in the house? Do you have children? So all of these things come into play, but to begin with, you're looking at, can I afford this without this other spouse's income? So you look at all these things, and so if the answer is like, I absolutely want to stay in this house, then you focus your entire strategy and plan around that. So it really comes down to, again, multiple different factors in terms of finances, but generally speaking, the things that you prioritize are things that you can accomplish with the right attorneys guiding you.